everyone, this is Ace to Wolf with the new beginning as Better Dice 10 40. Dire Portent. Therados has a. Uh, what? King of the Winter. He's granted there. Okay, so he's. That's weird. He's gonna have tons of resources. Uh, does that matter for Therados? I don't think. I never really played the nation. It doesn't. Like, his troops, I don't think they're that good. Are they? I don't know. I'm gonna find out, I guess. Okay, anyways, summoning tons of demons. Uh, Therados can do his silly things. It's like, what money is he going to have? He's a Dom Kill Nation to, uh, to spend on them. Okay. Okay, probing. Wow. Okay. We'll take that. Fuck this storm color. God, we can get fire mages, air mages, earth mages. All of them good researchers with good random magic paths. Uh, sorry if you can hear that in the background. <laughs> but, my goodness. These are some damn good mages that we've got here. Not least of all, because they're just astral two mages. So in, when in doubt, they can just steal their cascade things to death. My goodness. I don't know which one to get. Which one to start getting. Oh, we're just gonna ignore that storm though. He doesn't he doesn't matter anymore. I mean what's this guy got? Two water? Ugh. I'd rather much rather have the two astral. And then that shields all my armies as well from mind hunting and the like, should that become a problem. Um, they are incredibly old men, though, and they have a chance for fire paths, so I imagine this guy's just super old, too. Yeah. Okay, well. These are all damn good. I think we can go ahead and get, get this one. Yeah, seems like a good idea to me. Uh, and we can change these as, as needed. Uh, sadly, they're all put here, but that does give me enough astral pearls to sight search every single turn of the game from now on. So, eventually I will have enough to do this more. We've also got to check something on the Ice Devils. How many are there? What, six? We've got three now. I assume we did We did successfully do that. Excellent. Excellent. This guy's got his Icicle Fists. Nice. And uh, he likes the cold even more than his brothers, which is not exactly useful for us, since... Well, he's, he's, he's gonna have a tough time of it in the desert here, you know? We've got a bunch of wastelands and deserts, and, you know, we're not exactly up here in these, I don't know, these are probably called snow-capped mountains or something. No, we're fighting over these terrible wastelands with all... Oh, and then also other things happened, so... where were we? Looking through our magic sites. Our knowledge aspects. Right, this was like the last one. Arcane Probing found that. Uh, Blood Slaves did a fairly decent job, you know. Could be better. Longha, almost attacking. He broke the shitty palisade. I need to take a look at this guy again. He's susceptible to lightning. It's actually incredibly good for us because storm demons. Also, tons of lightning mages. Um, or air mages, you know, same, same difference. He's not resistant to cold, though. So that's another damn good thing for us, um, with all these ice devils about. I think that means he might actually take the fatigue damage from the cold, too, from the icicle fist dude. So he might be a good candidate for being a super command. because uh, if he knocks him unconscious, he can't run away with his winged shoes. He can't just click his heels and get out. Okay. I've just got to get fire at least. Ah, he started summoning demons. So what do we got our worm got here? Water 9, Earth 4. With a dousing rod for some reason. Okay. So yeah, I just... is this... oh, that's just a fire mouse. Like, wait, does he have a living spirit or a king or something? No. No, just a fire spirit. Yeah, 
Well, these actually aren't that bad with their ethereal. Hmm. Are these being buffed at all? Like, it doesn't seem like it. Defense skill of 18, that's just super experienced. Weapons of sharpness. All weapons are armor piercing, so armor's not going to do much. Okay. I don't know how that interacts with natural protection, though. That's something I need to figure out. Got our golem up here. Okay. It doesn't have any regeneration or anything, though, so the damage he does take is there for the duration. He does go ethereal, though. So magic weapons are a must. Quite fire resistant. I'm on a blade wings coming in. Where God's over here. I mean he does do a lot of regeneration, but he's he's got fair I think he iron skinned himself or something, because worms don't usually have that much protection. Okay. The golem got set on fire. having to look in this little corridor. I mean, the longer this goes, the more of um, Olm's units are just kind of getting burned to death, is the thing. So this guy's enraged. Okay. He has no... He only kills two units a turn. Is, is a problem here. And Olm units do a lot of damage. Well, this guy does have Fear 5, he might route them. They're not that brave. Where's... Oh, okay, the golem's back here, just killing mages. Got it. Worms losing half. The armies of all were routed. Next, come on, kill the golem, kill the golem! Yes! They killed the golem, I don't have to worry about it, not my problem. Oh, man. There we go. That's, that's how you do it, Lanka. Thank you. That was an excellent parting gift. Not that I'm going to, you know, do this siege any better. <laughs> the end. The god did live. That's disappointing. The best situation that could have turned out for me is they kill the golem, but the god dies. Okay, nice, though. He lost uh, five mages. One of them was the golem. Tons of units. All these things. Wonka's not got anything he can really, re you know, retaliate with. He might be able to take a couple of the provinces that are nearby. Um, wow, I got 20 province defense here. That's nice. I'll take it. And then I found a lab in this creepy marsh with 590 people, so it's not terribly useful to me. Except that I do need to fortify it, because it has a throne. And I should learn my lesson from every other game that I've ever played that I've lost, where I've just been thrown sniped. Okay. Well, let's see. First things first, we need to uh, find our nice blood mage here and make him bind another ice devil, because those are a limited commodity. Uh, just just to make sure, we did... yeah, this guy. Getting my turns mixed up sometimes about who I'm getting when. Okay, well that's nice. This guy can just only lead... Uh, all, he's, all he's really got to do is lead around demons, then. And, uh, it's, it's perfectly fine with me. What happened to this guy? I, like... Did he become slow? I thought I'd ordered this guy to move over there. Maybe I should leave him with some weird boots. Yeah, apparently he's not going to the Wasteland Survival. My mistake, that's gonna cost me a turn of setup. Oh well. We'll just have to deal with it. Okay. Storm demons, demon knights, storm demons, demon knights, demon knights. Although, we're actually gonna have this as a front line, so we don't really need the demon knights, but I like them. Um, although they're not going to be that as amazing against um, armor-piercing weapons, but 
Yeah, you know, in fact, I should probably start summoning Storm, Demon, Storm Demons again, just like exclusively after this, because killing them before they could touch me is the better option. Oh well, never mind. Okay. I don't know when. I mean, you're gonna command a bunch of demons. I mean, you can command a bunch of. You can command eighty. That's perfectly fine. Um, attack rear. Fire. He's not going to be a bad general. Uh, okay. So yeah, we got to work on our resists, I think, a little bit. This guy... This is probably what he's going to get. He's, a, he's not going to be terrible at fighting things. He can just research for now, because he's in the correct place. We're going to walk over here. Uh, got nothing going on over there. There's nothing interesting you can cast with your nature gems, is there? No, not really. Okay. Okay. Go ahead and take this man's shoes away and give him a stick. Put all the blood slurs back in, so we actually have more than we think. Again, take your shoes away. Here's the stick. Good luck, man. Okay, that's not going bad. We'll create a new laboratory here. That guy's already blood hunting. He'll get his stick next turn. I think we can take your shoes away, because you should be in the correct place to pick everyone up. Decent. Um, I think we can take this away from you. Although you're going to move up here because this is where we want to summon the demons. There we go. More storm demons. We do have defenses in everywhere. Yes. Good. We can put forward just a little bit more there. And there is a laboratory, so I should recruit a new priest. Send this one down. He'll bloodhead soon. Nice though. I like that. I like that Locke was able to repel that and kill the golem and all that. That's the disadvantage of, you know, never running away. Does Olm have a throne? You, you can just go back to blood hunting, you're fine. Don't worry about all these diseases and stuff. You can still find the virgins. It'll be fine. Just look for the ones that are even more averse to you. Okay. That was a big fuck up last turn. I tried to get this guy... You know, tried to get my... Be, uh, be cheap with my winged shoes. I shouldn't have done that. Okay. Uh, well, it looks like this guy might actually be our... Um, Rain Man. So we're going to have... We're going to have him cast... He can definitely cast Rain. Rain, and then Breath of Winter. And, uh... Whatever you want to do after that, we'll see what he does. But you can go ahead and hold our Waterlands. Which should give you... Yeah, yeah you can easily cast Rain. Because I think this army is going to be pretty much entirely about demons, and not so much about fire evocations. Okay. Not doing bad. This is a lot... This is, these eight priests here can go through a lot of blood slaves when I need to get up these armies of the Seder. Okay, it's not doing bad. I was just building another water bracelet. Oh, what a hell of a find, though, these metal spires. You know, those are like game-changing sort of events. So I picked these guys because, uh, gifts from heaven. 
I'm probably going to alternate between them and the Adepts of the Silver Order for Mistform Communions or something like that. Um, I can always hire uh, my priests. Even though they're Blood Mages, they can still do the Sabbath Master. It just costs one slave each time. Or a Sabbath uh, slave. Uh, and that way, it works with Astral Communions too. So you can boost them up that way. Yeah, it's all looking pretty decent. Not bad, bad. We don't really have terribly many demons on this front, though. I think I'll go ahead and recruit some more archers. May as well. And uh, that'll be it for turn 40. Our plans have been laid back because I'm an idiot. Uh, see you next time.